beautiful. See, it was, oh, there's the rainbow. It was over there. Let's see. It was, I, I did have it over here too, but now, just there. I forgot how many rainbows we do get. This, this will just stack up with fish. They're all cruising back into, back into Sugarloaf. I'm gonna have to, this is awesome. I love this bridge, but I'm gonna have to, uh, A, get to work, <laughs> but also get off this road. It's the direction to uh, go to Geiger Key for dinner. Shark, uh, shark key. A nice calm day. Water's glass. Anybody with a boat is out today. Friday as well. It's right off Geiger. Wow, look how beautiful. This is all super shallow. A couple feet, four feet, two feet, six inches. Atlantic. Oh, it looks like you can cut out there. I didn't know you can cut out through there. If if it's deep enough. Geiger Key. It's got to be uh, Air Force, obviously. I haven't seen sunlight out here, sunshine for weeks. Here, well, summer can be that way sometimes. It's just weird to see. But now look at the difference you can see in the, in the water so much more clear. Of course, the wind's down too, so that helps. Uh, no foggy, and, but but look at the, you can see the shallows now. Right there, here, you see a little bit of sand. The darker is turtle grass. Just, just grass, underwater grass. Look at the difference though. They've been waiting for weeks to get some sunnier pictures, not the doom and gloom I've been just getting recently, which is great for thunder shots sometimes, but um, normally we think Keys Beach is you're thinking sunshine, so.
Geiger key, jet going really slow. Really slow. Practically waved him there. Okay, so here's the second bridge out of Geiger. And this is where I saw a uh, my first alligator down here. And this was totally wild. It's not like you know blue hole where you you know the the alligators there. I should have time to get out. Look at the uh, egret down there. There's probably an egret every 20 feet. You know they love shallow water, which this is what this is shallow. Uh, looks it's only. Uh, this can be packed fish. I've seen this where you can walk across the fish, no joke. But there's an alligator down here. Uh, I haven't been down here for a year. There's the egret right there. Um, again, we used to live on Big Coppet, so, uh, and we only had one room. So I was like, I was coming out of the house, <laughs> out of the house, out of the room all the time. No TV. We didn't have TV, I forgot about that. Here, alligator. He's probably close, you know. Comes and snags people's bait when he's when they're fishing. I'm starting to get it now. I'm like, there's so much fish out there. Why don't they just go go get their own their food? But it's much more difficult unless you're hunting in a pack or, you know what I mean. You're just you're stabbing at, but like the the uh, egret out there, he's just waiting in the shallows like a stick and then ch harpoons one so he's got all day to sit there and he has so there he is he's gonna go bite something right now i doubt you guys can see him oh he's oh this is awesome i normally just see him standing there forever so he'll, he'll sit really still forever but he's gonna get something Oop. retracted his neck a little bit Anyways, oh, this goes out to the Atlantic on this side. Geiger Key, right here. I'm going to take you guys this way to uh, the beach over there. It's a pretty nice beach. No one's normally ever there. It's, it's really shallow, 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 shallow. So it's not like you're going to go, you know, get into eight feet really quick and swim. But you can, you know, you can take a little floaty and... and and dip down in the water and cool off or you can fish i fished out there before just waiting it's, it's pretty cool you can probably find a lot of wildlife actually you, you can find a ton of wildlife birds like crazy all right i'm gonna i'm gonna move towards the beach guys come down to Key West, Geiger. It's half underwater here too, so look at the rain. Look at all the water everywhere. Gasper boat, 635 a gallon. 
you got to think about what boats get per mile. Mile per gallon, 0.83 miles per gallon. Pretty nice camp spots right there. I'm sure they're reserved year after year after year ahead of time. A lot of these guys stay half a year, whole year, reserved year after year after year. 
So this is Geiger Key. Uh, Key West is that way. This is all really shallow back through here. This little cut has tons of fish, as you already see. But right through here, like tarpon will be here in here like crazy at night. And you can see the rip just slowly. It's, it's going pretty good. Getting closer to the uh, high tide and low tide, just you'll get more rip, more speed. Never fished back here. It should be really good fishing. A lot of these guys are fishermen. There's some houses right there. That's just like one little straight little point. Uh, I think it has like camping sites too for like a million dollars each. They, they have huts and all this stuff in them. Swimming pool. coming in or he just flashed his light. I can't even see it from here. I see a little bit of a ripple where he's at but no a flashlight like a like a um, spotlight. Uh-huh. Maybe it's surprising we had somewhere the sunset over here. Oh yeah? It like wraps all the way around. Oh. So cool. 